What up, y'all? How's it going? Ben Dean here. Today, What's up, Ben Dean? We're gonna be eating some pizza mm. fries. I've had fried pizza before, yeah, French fries on a pizza, on but I've never had pizza French fries. Have you ever the other had way pizza around. French fries? Basically, you no, got a bunch of amazing. fries on the bottom. You got some sauce, cheese, and pepperoni and olives for this one. Yeah, that looks like great. they also have a little bit of a, a green mix, perhaps some basil or some kind of herb. But uh, anyway, I got two orders of these fries and a Coke, and it came out to about 21 together. bucks. This is a good amount of he food. Said 20 bucks. Um, and it looks really good as it well. I'm ready great. to dig in. This is one of those foods that's not really going to hold up uh, as well. That looks so Getting satisfying. delivered, mm -hmm. you know, it would probably be a lot better. Fresh at the restaurant, but got to do what you got to do. It'll still got taste mighty fine, it. I believe. So, the olives look wonderful. as you can see, the fries over there, the I cheese, like the sauce, the pepperoni, a little bite Didn't of everything. Did you say earlier, except an olive. like the chill kind of muck bun. Yes, Got definitely. it. Got the olive on there as well. And uh, let's go in for a bite. Mm, I love black olives. It's just good vibes over that here. Looks good. Well, guess what I would like to try? Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. Like some nacho chicken, <laughs> nacho chicken. I didn't really know what to expect. To be honest, it smells like pizza up in here. Wow. And to be honest, again, it kind of it tastes like pizza. Mm. But with the fry base, a potato base. A whole different eating, eating experience. Nice. I gotta say, usually I never eat pizza with a fork. <laughs> and this is like a, a Chicago style deep dish or something, which. Mm -hmm. And I'll even eat those with my hands. But the eating experience is different. The mouth feel. I learned that word that the other day. I don't know if that's like a hipster thing, but mouth, mouth feel. feel. It tastes it's different in the mouth with the fries. Yeah. That makes sense. My arms. That's like the herbs. He said, you're obviously. right, because see, when you think of pizza, you think of like biting it and the crust. French fries. Yeah. Not like fries and Arm, stuff. That's not In my opinion, amazing. more flavorful, uh, probably worse for you than just a regular crust. He says probably that, worse I mean, for this you. Is, I mean, two of some it's of my joy. favorite foods, pizza, my favorite food, and french fries. Mm. You know what, I know what that gives me, that puts that in mind, right. Penn Station. You know the yeah, pizza? Yeah, it looks kind of like I've never like had it, it but mom wrong. had it, the Penn wrong. Station uh, pepperoni sandwich, yeah. and then the Penn Station yeah. fries. And I think I had it one time, it was just a long time ago. It reminded me of that, except for it's in a sandwich form. Yeah. That looks amazing. It looks satisfying. Right. The only thing is, <laughs> something like that I probably would have on a hot plate than on the cover, uh, cover, mm -hmm. the cutting board, because you know it's going to get cold quick, quickly instead of holding the heat. That looks amazing. I love them big giant mouth. All food. them fries. <sighs> That's nice. Because as y'all know, your girl Honey is down for the mukbangs. I'm a mukbanger. That's where I started. Mukbanger. Sure pizza with just about most So check your girl out. And you could turn it into some kind of creation. I remember back in the day. He technically Coca Cola. They put a lining burger. in the. I used to work uh, for Coca Cola. What else they have? Pizza. Mm -hmm. And they put a lining pizza in the. Pizza bagel. I mean, that's pretty similar. But oh my God, I, I used to know the best. Just know that I don't drink can pop. I don't drink pop here. They had a pizza bagel. It was at the uh, I lied. Was at a I restaurant a, at the uh, college where my dad works at. That one soda. Uh, mm -hmm. That ruined soda, the cherry one. Mm -hmm. That's it's like drinking candy. It's good. It's called the Gizmo, low key place. They used to have the best, hands down, can't beat it. The best pizza bagel you can ever you can ever eat. Ooh. And it was I forget the price, but I think you got uh, a full bagel, so two halves for something like two fifty or something, maybe three bucks. You know, he, he's from America, really. Well, I think he was born oh, in my. Korea and he was adopted in America. It's a big was, that's one of those When I first followed that, him, he was talking about that, how he was adopted uh, and how he moved you know, back to growing Korea. Growing up, I love bagels. I always have bagels in the house. And a lot of times, you know, I'd have some sauce and some cheese, you know, mozzarella I cheese. I have to admit, South Korea be jamming with around. the food. I would always try to make pizza bagels at home. I'm going to get me a fork. I'm gonna get me a I try out different form. techniques. When I start milk bonging again, I'm gonna, remember that fork I found? It was a pretty giant golden fork. Uh, sometimes when I'm real lazy, just put them in the microwave. Uh, we also had growing up 
something called a pizza pizzazz. It's kind of like the kind of crumbling the pizza pan yeah. Yeah. that cooks from the top and the bottom. Like they kind of break it. In the middle. Right it's a little device. Like where he's forking. Because he can't, it's like he can't get it on his fork. Why don't he take that chunk right but, there? But uh, we have one of those, so I'll try to make him a piece of bagels on See, that right as well. Yeah, My right brother, there. Yeah, uh, well, that's what I said. Well. <laughs> Could never, I mean, they're good. We made some decent little pizza bagels, but nothing like the gizmo. Oh, why you Yeah, he pushed it. Like, bro, tear into that. Saying, I don't know the yeah, secret to that place. That now we know how it feels to wa be watching mukbangs eat. Right. It'll it's get you a good. saliva glands going and make you want that. What else is that? Pizza. He took it out off Pizza here. fries. He cut it all together. Like that? that chunk was for us to see and bite and love. Pizza. He pizza cut that. Is that a thing? He took the best part out. It's all good. He got some more on that side. Yeah, you do. I'm I'm essentially just put some, uh, it's, some I love watching people eat because it's like you have all this food in front of you and then you slowly favorite, see it vanish. Uh, it's like magical. Uh, mm. Favorite sandwich topping back in the day. And if you haven't, ha if you haven't, I'm sure you have, but if you haven't tried it. Mm, the that's a nice sandwich chunk. Pepperonis, man. That, that's a nice chunk. Me. Back in the day, I you used to be a really picky eater. So I would go to Subway, right? And I'll get a pepperoni sandwich. Pepperoni and mustard on bread. That's a good bite. Yeah. That was a great bite. Mm. I'm sorry, I would have to have maybe more I, I ingredients on the side. Maybe I wasn't deep like this, but like that's an example of like and, and some cheese what kind of sandwich cheese is that? That's such a pepperoni sandwich. Dumping it on all the other Pretty fries. Sure I used to hate olives. I love olives. But they're low-key good. I think I've, I've said it before. Stuff like olives and, uh, I mean, I'm just ranting on about pizza today, but stuff like olives and mushrooms. You probably know somebody who doesn't like one of the two. <laughs> when you bake it on a pizza. I don't like mushrooms. You don't like mushrooms? I can, if mushrooms are on it, I won't pick it off, I'll eat it. But I won't order it. You already know I don't like mushrooms. It's yeah. not a surprise. You did. That's because what happened to you was little. If you want to convert, we'll tell you about that in another <clears throat> mushroom. In another pizza. in another video. Why I don't like <laughs> mushrooms? I'll try to buy like some good mushroom pizza, <laughs> mushroom pepperoni or something. Because once you mushrooms to me give your food a certain flavor, kind of like black olives. You know, gives it a, a certain different flavors. That's what I do with my girlfriend. Mushrooms. And mushrooms do actually taste good when it's with, you know, your meat and vegetables and mixed up with all everything else. Right. Like olives. It's just what ticks me off, really ticks me right off about. And they're healthy. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't really tick me off, but just like, what? I just don't really get it. What? About my all right, well, like, for me, I didn't have my full, I'm full now. Right yeah. Now. It full. looked at the bomb. That was fun though. Yeah, it was. Well, I don't know about y'all, but y'all make sure y'all stay tuned because we are going to be mukbanging soon. And again, yeah. like I said in the other video, that you know I'm just waiting to move to a city. Let me know what city y'all in and what city is popping with all the organic, all natural restaurants, grocery stores. I know out west is banging with all that. So y'all let us know in the comments. Yeah. Then your boy Ben Dean with South Korea where they oh, invented mukbanging, mukbanging, and which means a large amount of food you eat in front of the camera. Anyway, he's in South Korea, he's a good dude. Y'all make sure y'all check him out. On to the next one, on to the next one, on to the next one, on to the See next one. See ya in the next one. See ya, peace. Bye.